because I'm trying to be who I've been all along. It's all my life. What's up and welcome back. Today we're gonna be going for a ride, a 1948 sedan. This one here is believed to be 350 under the hood. With power steering. Pretty quiet motor. Sweet little setup. If you're new to the channel, hit subscribe. I post videos like this daily. We also have financing and shipping available for you and 100 detailed pictures. This one has front disc brakes, drums on the rear. We're gonna be stopping getting gas. Looks like a locking gas cap. Dual exhaust out the back. Pretty sweet. Okay, guys. It's about that time. Let's go for a ride. Oh, hey, where'd you come from? <laughs> All right, getting ready to take off. We're gonna look around the interior, kind of check some stuff out. Looking around in here. Let's get away from these old guys. <laughs> I was hoping he heard me. <laughs> look at that. So we got a set of gauges under the dash here. Oil pressure's up to 50. Engine temperature's not quite up yet. Voltmeter is not working doesn't mean that the it's not charging it's probably just not hooked up Look, told you I give up I don't even know I don't, I don't even know what that does but I just broke it that's great let's see what it does here I'm gonna flip it, it needs a new switch now whatever it is <laughs> that's crazy well, I was getting ready to go I don't know what that does, guys. It's probably going to be this blower motor down here. Um, sorry. <laughs> Go ahead and show you the mileage that's popping up on the dash. I cannot stand behind that. That's a 48 model for you. Um, we'll switch up here. I'll tell you what, everything's stripped out. That's definitely not going to spin that little notch. That should go to the windshield wipers up here but it's not working. We got an aftermarket column. You see that would be like an early 90s Chevrolet. Turn signals and stuff. We'll be checking that out in the walk around video. Let's try this horn. Did you place your bets? It doesn't work. <laughs> All right, let's see how it runs and drives down the road. Um, I gotta say that gas gauge doesn't work, but we're definitely gonna get some gas because I'm not running out of fuel with her. A couple speakers in the back. Headliner is in incredible shape. I love the way that looks. It's huge bubble in here. Even got your sun visor. You don't need a ball cap to ride in this one. Let's roll. She's still laughing at me, making fun of me <laughs> about this little thing here. All right. There's no seat belts in here. So you just gotta hang on to me. <laughs> All right, we're gonna take off down the road. Um, I didn't put my do not block entrance sign up, so as soon as I did that, I got blocked. Check this out. Literally, the whole parking lot next door. Steering column's making a little whispering noise. Maybe she, hey, I need to move. You can go forward. Should've got the cones out. Gotta get the cones out. People just don't know. That's all it is. Uh-oh. We really got to get the cones out. Look. <laughs> Another entrance blocker. Oh, my goodness. Let's go. I'm going to tell you everything about this car. That's why I do these videos. Oh, he's going to ride down with us. This thing is very noisy. Just hold it and it'll stop doing that. Speedometer's coming up on the dash. Steering wheel's not perfectly straight. Let's see if the car's pulling any. It is. It's pulling to the right. I'll let go. We do fade to the right. That being said, as soon as I turn, it turns. Very tight steering. Need to get the Allen wrenches out and fix that. 
That rattle will go away if I had an Allen wrench with me. Let's see if the kick down's hooked up. You ready? I don't think it is, but it's definitely getting down. She's got plenty of power. Brakes, they're stopping fast. We've got good brakes on this car. And of course, the next stop is the gas station. I'm just gonna say the gas gauge doesn't work, but I mean, who knows? I'll try it out. That thing's pretty old. It's sitting on E. It's actually a pretty smooth ride, what do you think? Not bad, is it? Let's hit this bump here. Better than my truck. <laughs> <laughs> It rides better than a, a, a new model truck, guys. It's probably just a Chevrolet. They all ride rough. <laughs> Not bad. So we'll pull in here and get some fuel. We'll keep this test drive rolling. Me and her are probably going to take off to lunch in the middle of this video. And uh, maybe it'll get a little bit more exciting. Try not to break anything. All right, wait, gas cap's on the other side. I did remember that. Better have a key, okay, yeah, fuel key. Good deal. We'll circle the whole gas station. Kinda like a car. here at the gas station i'm gonna put about twenty dollars worth of fuel in this car you can see i already got it in the back here locking gas cap works very cool high test that's what we're going with and hopefully that gas gauge does work she's a little bit ancient but we're gonna be finding out here in a minute okay Look at that little nub there. I'll turn this car on. Come on up. Come on up. It don't work. I didn't think it did. Uh, no other gas cage on the dash here. But I know we got fuel. Let's keep rolling.
Visor's got a, I gotta sit low for the visor. You're way up in the air. What are you doing way up here? So far so good. Walk around video turned out. Definitely check it out. Uh, we're gonna go get us some barbecue and call it a day, but we're gonna finish up this test drive. We'll drive straight there. This whole thing's got a little bit of pep. When I gave it the throttle, it uh, it ate the pavement. I'm sure y'all saw that. Man, I'm gonna do this real quick before we leave. I forgot in the walk around video to check the lights. And you know what, we're doing that. Lights are on, turn signal is working. A good sign. Tail lights are on and turn signals working. I guarantee the other one's gonna work. Let's hit the road. Everything's working. Cool. I'm gonna cut it off before I forget, and then we ha have to call for a jump box. You know how many times I've done that during the day? I don't even want to tell you. It's embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> I shouldn't even told you. <laughs> Rolling. Did you say? Make you a daisy garden. All right. We're still good here. Nice and smooth. Still pulling to the right. I mean, if I let go, Bree will be in the mailbox over here. <laughs> that's as is flopping around in the back yes these cars are sold as is it's hard to warranty something from 1948 but there is a company out there I had a guy come in and he said that they have uh, insurance like that or warranties like that that you can call I think we even have the cards of the lot so if you're interested they actually do have it but you got to pay monthly for it of course that's not through maple motors at all that's just somebody walked in and told us about their company a few of our customers have chosen to do that too i don't blame them for what it cost it was pretty cheap the end of the test drive here we're going to a uh what's that guy fury y'all ever seen that food channel show the blonde guy with spiky hair drives diners, a camaro drive what is it called diners drive-ins and dives i think that one? yeah i believe so maybe his name's not is it guy fury yeah, yeah it is guy yeah he drives the the camaro around the convertible anyways he came to this place over here so if you ever come to hendersonville i want you to check this out it's called center point barbecue local business here and you can probably watch an episode on it we're gonna eat barbecue y'all probably kind of know my general area from my videos we're kind of breaking off towards another route where Best Buy was where I took my buddy Derek y'all ever seen that episode where I gave him the GoPro we're literally right in the middle of that, and the barbecue place is right here. She says that the handles are stiff. When she's rolling, to, show them how you roll down the window. <laughs> is it a little oh, stiff? It's getting a little bit better. Is it? Yeah, it's getting, oh, going up this harder. <laughs> <laughs> Need to get the WD-40 out. Yeah, going up this harder. <laughs> Let's try this. Yeah, it's definitely a little bit stiff. These old tracks need to be old. A lot of the old cars are like that. She knows from my car. <laughs> so yeah, right after we pull up over here, uh, I'll show you this place, let you check it out. That way when you come to town, you can uh, go eat here.
car's pretty sweet. You don't see many of these out. And this place is jumping today. Hopefully we can get in pretty quick. It's jumping, jumping. Let's find us a good little spot here. We'll park on the end away from everybody. The pole can't den us. They've been here since 1965. That's pretty good. All right. I'll see y'all later. I want to thank you for watching this video. Be sure to hit subscribe. Check out maplemotors.com. Detailed pictures of every car on the lot. All of our inventory is always listed. I know it's low right now. Next week, we'll have 10 more cars on, and we'll do that for every week. I'll see you later, guys. Thanks for watching. This place is pretty awesome. What do you think? I already started eating. You got fried pickles, three little pigs, which is just barbecue, little mini barbecue sandwiches. And they've got like a bunch of sauces. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And they've had lots of famous artists come through here. Of course, Taylor Swift, I went to school with her. This place is awesome. Old money. Come check it out.